Hey guys, so this is going to be my first review with this camera. Uh, it's a very nice camera. I haven't had it very long, but uh, this is going to just be a review of the Diane Guhong. I was going through my cubes and I realized I hadn't had a, I don't have a review of a Guhong, a true Guhong, not the pink one or the colored one. Uh, the colored one, uh, I'll be recording and it'll come out soon. Uh, but this is the normal Guhong. I got mine in white. You the insides. Here's the insides right there. Um, if you don't know what a guhong is, it comes in three pieces. There's, uh, yeah, three pieces. You can probably see right there. It splits in three. Uh, edges split in two. You can see I can take those apart pretty easily. Split in two. Uh, they fit together. Boom, there, fit together. Um, and then when they're together, they look like a ball, like they're surrounding a ball. I'll show you the insides right here. As you can see, there's a tight little space right in there. Um, that is what I mean by the ball. Just fits right next to the, uh, the core. It has a white, uh, off-white core. Nothing too special about it. Uh, great cube, uh, one of the best out there. There was the whole Verde's Guhong mess, uh, but that's no longer uh, happening. Verde's has decided to undo their claim that Guhong was copying them, so now it's free to sell. Um, let's see, I'll show you a center cap. Here's a center cap. Nothing too special. Here's the insides. Uh, I first lubed mine with CRC, which is a pretty good lube. Uh, then I lubed it with... Uh, I took that out, rinsed it out, and then I lubed it with Maru Lube. Maru Lube is one of the best lubes to lube the Guhong with if you do not have Lubix. Once you put Lubix in here, this thing becomes freaking amazing. Uh, it can cut corners like you know, that's almost 45 as you can see just under 45 and it's cutting it like a piece of cake um, this cube has a very smooth feeling you can hear that uh, nothing too special about it uh, just very smooth uh, other than that, it's a great cube. Smooth really isn't my thing. I like more crispy cubes, such as the high-end memory. Uh, but this cube is nice. It's, it's a fast cube. It's controllable. It doesn't pop unless you have it tensioned wrong. Uh, if you have it really, really loose, it will it will pop on you, but not very often. Um... My only problem with this one is when I was using CRC, it melted the center cap in. I have done everything I can to get it off. I can't. I've used a knife. Um, yeah, it just doesn't work. Stickers are pretty good. They tend to chip. They don't peel. As you can see, the red side has some chips in the blue. It's a hair. Um, green side, I don't know if I showed that. This, I don't know how that happened. You can see that. Um, I don't know. Just, I like dropped it and it, the whatever. Uh, yellow side is actually really good right now. So, this, it, I, it's stickered just with the stickers that come with it. Uh, very good stickers. Nothing wrong with them. You can do the uh, Lubix, or the Ultimate and Elite mod. Uh, uh, Donovan, uh, the Lubix guy, uh, big fan of his uh, his product and his videos, so giving you a shout out. Um, his link to his channel will be in the description. If you want to mod your Guhong to be an ultimate, or you can go buy an ultimate or elite from him. Uh, they're great cubes. I don't plan on getting one one day. I just I'm getting the X cube, and I don't want to spend all my money right now. Other than that, this cube. Other than that, yeah. I don't know what else to say. 
uh, it's just a plain old great cube. Uh, one of the standards out there, and I would really recommend getting it. Some kind of Gu Hong. There's the colored Gu Hong. And there's other colors of Gu Hong, uh, like you can get on Cube Depot, you can get red, blue, green, black, white, pink, I think. Um, the only problem is as a DIY kit, uh, sometimes a core arm will be stripped and you have to like push it in, really grind it into the core, but once it's in it's fine and it adjusts fine that's really the only problem especially when it first came out they might have fixed it by now uh, I've had this cube a while still one of my favorite this in my memory but yeah there's that's just I would recommend this to anybody who wants a new cube that's fast it's efficient um, it will help your your times out and I'll show you guys a solve I'll see you in one sec Hey guys, so uh, here's the solve. Got my stack mat plugged in. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna scramble this. Twenty-six point eight three, not the greatest solve, but uh, not bad either. So yeah, that's the Diane Gu Hong. I hope you guys have enjoyed my review and solve. Subscribe. I'm thinking about doing a uh, walkthrough solves and comparison of all my four by fours right now. Uh, I might wait for the X cube. I'm not sure. Um, check out my blog. Uh, I've been posting a bunch of stuff lately. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.